kind of like a bootleg. <laughs> it's kind of like a bootleg, <laughs> but it's not. Anyway, we are just, Pee Pee and I, Merry Christmas, Pee Pee. Merry Christmas. Say, I was not happy about taking my medicine today. He was not happy about taking his medicine today. So, Alex tried and I tried and we finally got it done, but it just was like total hell today. Um, I'm going to show you guys these. We're getting ready to go to his aunt's house. I just filmed a video and I'm uploading it. Just a quick little video. And um, I'm putting my, I have to put my lights up. And um, <laughs> put my bag of fans away. Anyway, um, I'll take that. Okay, so I bought these, you guys, the other day at Kohl's. These Woodwick ones. Have you seen these? Oh my god. Okay, so I bought three of them. Well, one of them are Kirkland. They're not, but the other two are. And this one is highly fragranced wax melt, flickering fireside. It smells exactly like a fireplace in here. It is, it smells so good. It's unbelievable. So, there's that. As you can see, I am in a much better mood today. We woke up today. I woke up with my husband rubbing my back, which was really sweet. And I was like, oh, I didn't even reach for my phone. I was like, what am I going to have to deal with? And, um... It was amazing. I mean, the support that I have received in the last 24 hours is just surreal. And um, it's snowing outside, so I got my white Christmas. And um, then we went to brunch at Cafe Patashu, and I had an omelet and coffee. It was delicious. It was very empty. And then I went and got, I, went, I will show you tomorrow. I went and got a bunch of dog stuff from Santa Paws, because <laughs> Santa Paws. Dad, when is Santa Paws coming? Dad, is Santa Paws coming? Oh, Boo Radley, is Santa Paws coming? Boo Radley, is Santa Paws coming? <laughs> They're so sweet. So anyway, um, so I got a bunch of pet stuff. Alex ran some errands, I ran some errands, and now we're home, and he just got done getting ready, and I'm going upstairs to get dressed, and then we're gonna go over to his aunt's house. For Christmas! <laughs> so anyway, I will uh, be back a little bit later, you guys. Uh oh, it's cousin Maya. What's the light here going on here? Hi. Cousin how are you, Maya. How you doing? Oh. Maya's so a dancer like Alice. You. She's here from Vegas. Always. 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 You miss always. Vegas? I do. I do actually. Carlitos. <laughs> this is Christmas. Although people are usually always on the phone talking to somebody from home. I'm talking to you right now. You're talking to me right now? Oh yes, I am. Okay, let's go sit over here. Look at all these presents. Oh my lord. Oh my lord. So everybody wore pajamas tonight except for Carlos and I. Alex's pajamas are very fashionista. <laughs> Sebastian! Maya has onesie on. Aww. Onesie on. Do some dancing for us. Do some dancing for us. Can, some music, so Can you do some dance. salsa? Oh, look at the back. <laughs> okay. This is literally. We had dinner already. It is. Uh, Ten thirty. Santa Claus comes at midnight. Santa Claus is coming. To town. Why does Santa Claus come at midnight? Is there a reason for that? Because it's it's twenty fifth, motherfucker. Like, <laughs> what did he say? I don't know what he said. Because it's twenty fifth, <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> I, I will. I need something. Say Merry Christmas, Ed. Merry Christmas. Happy. Yes. Happy yes. Christmas. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. Wow. Shit. Everybody is cussing so much, my lord. Good thing that that uh, bear is coming into some good use. Alex, what are you watching? He is watching. He watches these funny memes. 
Ed, would you say that that's the most comfortable onesie? Oh my God, you and my—I didn't know you had matching onesie. Yeah, I guess. We all, we all do. Are you blind, dude? Am I what? Blind. <laughs> no. Look at the babies playing. Games. He's a Zara shirt. Did you give him a Zara shirt? Did you give that to Carlos? <laughs> <laughs> Ed, do you need help? Yeah, I will in one second. Oh, I was hoping you'd say no. <laughs> Alex, how's your Christmas been so far? Good. You're starting to get relaxed and comfortable, aren't you? We had a good brunch today. What'd you have at brunch? Yeah. There's my mother-in-law, Hungria. Say, Merry Christmas, Hungria. Feliz Navidad. Merry Christmas, everybody. What do you want to say? Merry Navidad, boy. Focus. Carlos. Don't forget his dad. What did he say? Merry Christmas, everybody. I love everybody. Everybody's a good person. That's not what he said. He said that he loves everybody. And he hope everybody have a wonderful Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I should get up and help. Carlitos, is Santa Claus going to come? Carlitos, what time is Santa Claus coming? What? <laughs> what time does Santa Claus come, Hungria? At midnight. Why at mid? Why at midnight though? Because he's born. Jesus born in the twenty fifth. Okay, so Jesus was born on the twenty fifth. So Santa Claus comes on. And we are celebrating his birthday. Okay, so and why does Santa Claus have to do it? Well, because he wanted to take his time to open for the name of Jesus. Christ. Okay. Now, when you guys, when Alex was growing up, you guys used to go to the beach and stuff at Christmas time. Sometimes, sometime. no Christmas. Yeah. Christmas was always at home, but during the time, yeah. Yay. And one time, one day, we started driving at 10, <laughs> and the beach was kind of two hours oh, out, far okay. away. You have oh, to my and then we had to drive, drive, drive. We get to the beach. What's going to happen? At 11.45, we set, we get to the house, we set the table, mm -hmm. and uh, Five minutes before midnight, we started counting. <laughs> Was that the year that Maya hid in the trunk? <laughs> no. What did I do? You hid in the trunk of the car. Isn't there a Probably story about that? It's one of those things. I know, no, 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 no. What's another time? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, GD. Liliana, say Merry Hi, Christmas. Yay. Feliz Navidad. Oh my God, careful. Okay, Miss Venezuela, can you do yeah. the walk? Hey, okay, so. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, this is Everybody's wearing right. onesies. Ale va a ser bien bello, ale mira, hermoso. Thank you. Okay, so this is Oh. Pone una pone una So this is my Christmas. I'm just sitting here. This one is Maya. Oh. And No. Hi baby. <sighs> I have, who's phone? I have another bottle of Bell in here. Oh, it's my phone. And I just got a message from Whitney okay. M. And Whitney, thank you so much. Your message meant the world to me. Are you doing pictures? Well, I'm trying. If you drop that child, Maya. <laughs> Okay, you are busy. Okay. Don't be in the picture. He said. Come here, Carlitos. Carlitos. You don't want to be in the picture. Okay. Mama. Carlitos. What's, we are Mama. the two lone Mama. English, English is a first language people. Do you have anything you'd like to say to the people, Ed? No. Ed is Maya's stepfather. And my... Come on, Maya. Ed, what, 
Ed, what are you to me? Here, oh. do the other one here. So take it on my picture, in my photo, no. in my phone, and then you're my mother-in-law's brother-in-law. Yeah. Let me call my mom. Uncle, you're my uncle-in-law. Uncle. Mommy. Mommy. Thank God for Ed. That's all I have to say. <laughs> Be careful with Teddy Bear. Teddy Bear's been around for a long time. Ed was telling me sad don't stories. Be don't about be what? Mean to about Jack, the don't dog. Be mean oh. to teddy bear. Now I'm sad about Pete. Nice Those teddy are good bear. pictures of you guys. Alex has good pictures of everybody. That's really cute. Oh, I love it. We Maya? Still we still have to crop it like from here up. <laughs> Watch this. <laughs> Maya, we miss you. We think you should move back to Indianapolis. Uh, Absolutely not. <laughs> but Maya has you lived guys in, can come visit me anytime. Maya has like. lived in LA and in Las Vegas. And it's absolutely wonderful. Venezuela, Indianapolis. Where and else? And unfortunately, in Indianapolis is my least favorite. Speaker but <laughs> my family lives here and I absolutely enjoy visiting them. So she's a backup dancer for Britney Spears in Las Vegas. I wish, I wish I that's like Where do you work in Las Vegas? Trip. Do you want to say? Um, I work. Now everybody, there's a lot of people that watch this. So. <laughs> um, come see me. Come tip her. <laughs> um, it's called Tom Serpin at New York, New York. All right. Come see me. Where's your favorite club to go out and see DJs and stuff at in Vegas? L.A. In no, LA? Vegas. Yeah. Okay, where in L.A.? Uh, well, Vegas, I uh, would we'll definitely go check it out. Uh, check out Techno Taco Tuesday, which is our brand, and which is what we're trying to push. Techno Taco no Tuesday. Techno Taco Tuesday. Well, sit over here. My arm is I tired. will be sitting right next to you. Okay. So, Techno Taco Tuesday is our mantra brand, and uh, we very definitely serious, do. <laughs> Everything techno, so everything, yeah. everything underground techno. in the techno scene. Uh, we do she and Alex to Las Vegas. Okay, now and, Los, Los um, Angeles. What's your favorite club? My favorite favorite club in Los Angeles is called Lots at Twin Three, which is a uh, pretty much like a warehouse. <laughs> and what's your favorite thing about me? What's my favorite thing about you? <laughs> when you're do you remember the first time you met me? Everything. What did I say to you the first time I met you? God, I, don't, I don't remember the first time I met you. Oh, I do. It was with Luz. And I said, you better be nice to my cousin. I'll come she back said, after you. Yeah, she said, you better be nice to my cousin. And now look, see? Now she's my cousin. And now he's my cousin. And uh, I'll never forget, mm -hmm. we went out and we were walking through Broad Ripple. And this is how I learned about how Alex and Maya are trickers, okay? <laughs> because we're walking down the street. He <laughs> We're walking down the street and Maya and Alex are speaking in English, okay? And they're talking about like somebody on the street in front of us and literally like halfway through the sentence Switch. switches into Spanish. And I was like, what are you guys talking about? Talking and, about. and Alex goes, it doesn't matter. And then Maya tells me everything because she always told me everything. <laughs> <laughs> I always tell you everything. Carlitos is such a good kid. Look at him over there. He is like totally playing by himself. Carlitos, she deserved to get everything in the world for Christmas because you're yes, such a good do. brother. Are you excited for Santa to come? Yes! yes. Did you go and tell Santa? Did you, you went and saw him, right? No, because I hear something. Bye -bye. Don't oh. hurt yourself, Carlitos. Be careful. Did you write a letter to Santa? What? Did you write a, a letter telling Santa Claus what you want? <laughs> yeah, I saw you mail it to the mailbox of the North Pole, right? What are you watching right now? Don't I'm watching I don't on my Snapchat. <laughs> Maya's looking at her Snapchat. What's your Snapchat in case people would want to follow you? Um, my Snapchat is... Which I don't remember. Ms. underscore Maya V-E. She don't know. Oh, Ms. Maya the Dancer Maya's or v. something. Yes, Miss Maya. Oh, I actually looked kind of cute in that Snapchat for a second. Oh, that's what I thought. Hello. <laughs> I always have for your back, silly. Maya arranged the onesies, of which I didn't do because none of them were comfortable for me. Maya uh, also arranged, your, was it your mom that arranged the Secret Santa? Yes, present? we so did the Secret Santa. We they host the Christmas. Um, I they're, basically the Chris, they're basically fun Christmas and silly. elves. They're basically yeah. Christmas elves. Yeah, it's just so. fun and silly. Now, what was the weather like in Vegas when you left? Um, Alex was just out there and he saw your house and said he loved way it. Way better, way better than here. There's snow in here. But I right got now. my white Christmas. I know, I'm happy for you. Thank you. I just got it from far away. Uh -huh. We're trying to find Maya a really good husband. No, I'm okay with that. 
guys. Whoever's out there, don't marry me. D Promise. Don't say that. Um, Maya is one of the most incredible dancers you have ever seen in your yes. entire life. I will be a best partner, not wife. Good partner. Well, I mean, maybe that, if that's your choice, you don't need to get married. Thank you. <laughs> that's they are these two. Let me just tell you. Okay, so the first time that I saw Alex and Maya dance together, look at him, my nephew and my godson. I still haven't had to buy that bracelet thing yet, have I? Mm -mm -mm. The baby is the cutest. So the first time that I ever saw Maya, yeah, we're almost done. Okay, mm -hmm. so the first time that I ever saw you have unicorns on that. I know the, unicorn Santa. The first time that I ever saw Maya and Alex <laughs> dance together was at the Jazz Kitchen. Yes, that's and it was. Fun. Packed. And, it was and awesome. I literally thought I had walked into like a club in South America. It was so cool. Yeah, it was awesome. And um, everybody was beautiful and it was very kind of like sexy and dark and loungy. And they entered the salsa contest. Yeah. And they danced to Celia Cruz's La Negra. Yeah, La Negra tiene tumbao. That's like my favorite song yes. ever. Except for that new one that we were just listening to. What's it called? Uh, I don't know which one. If I, if I show it to you, can you tell me? Because I know the... Uh, Probably. I will have to. Carnival. No, it's not Carnival. No. It's this one right here. Yeah. It's one of those that you Back like. Up. Let me see. Um, we were just listening to it. That song. Uh, what's it called? Is this it? No, it's not. No, no, no. Okay, well, this is what we were just listening to. Mm -mm, mm -mm. It was um, it was Mark Anthony. That's Projecto Uno. No, it's Mark Anthony. What we were just listening to is Mark na, na, Anthony. Na, 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 na. Well, I have it on here. It's Mark Anthony. But I don't have any Mark Anthony on here. You should. Here, let me type it in. Hold on a second. That wasn't it. Mark Anthony. No. Peter. What? Why does Carlos have a, a thing on his coat that says Bruce Wayne? He said he wanted to be something different. We're trying to find the song. Do you know what the song is? I know I have Look it. Look cute. Take care of Alina. Okay. It's really cute. Mommy! No. I do not have any Mark Anthony on here you though. Have some Mark How do you pronounce it? It's M-A-R-C. Anthony. <laughs> <laughs> do you miss it? Do you miss him with Jennifer Lopez? Uh, yes. I don't fucking know. I do. Do you I, listen to Latino music? Yeah, yes, he does. But I think that Mark Anthony. He does Anthony, more than I do. Listen, I think that Mark Anthony <laughs> was the only person that could tame Jennifer Lopez. You guys like all love Mark Anthony and um, Shakira. I love Shakira. I, love I do. Shakira. I really do. Same. Do you like Shakira because your wife looks like Shakira? Her hips don't lie. <laughs> I was waiting for that joke, actually. That is such, <laughs> such a great joke. Yeah. I was that just thinking. Super cute. Aww. I was just thinking earlier that like our Latino Christmases are always all of us, great food, and everybody great on company. their and everybody on their phones talking to somebody in Venezuela. Well, yeah, talking to somebody. Waiting around for midnight. Waiting around for midnight. Yep. Yes. 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 <laughs> Mm -hmm. Yes, we are. We just don't have my mom here. She's like, mm -hmm. it's like your first year. I know your mom's not years. here. Is she sad that she's not here this year? She's kind of, well, she's all right. She's it's probably man. She never really understood why we had to wait till midnight. She, yeah, she never did. She, she was like, <laughs> okay, I'm ready to go to bed. Go to bed. Alex, can you do that? Um, oh, rocker thing. No, I don't do that. Can you do? <laughs> I know that's actually kind of a cute picture of it me. Who's that really girl? Good. Oh, is that Angie? No, no, no. Yeah. Oh, yeah, it is. It is Angie. Oh, oh. She looks good. Mm -hmm. Oh, shit. Sometimes she wears like real heavy makeup. I was kind of. Did you see that yesterday? Me too, I was real me surprised too, me that too. picture. I was like, honey, you huh? look like that blue eyeshadow is from yeah. 1975. Oh, it's getting dark and moody in here. It's getting dark in here. So take off of your clothes. <laughs> it's getting hot in here. It's hot in here. Okay. I'll be Miss Santa. Christmas with the family. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Ooh. Alex, what's your favorite Christmas song? I already know this. 
We um, wish you a Merry Christmas. No. We wish you a Merry Carol Christmas. Carol of the Bells is his favorite song. Carol of the Bells. What's your, fa Mary, what's your favorite Christmas song? New Year. And you can't say some Latin dance song that doesn't have anything to do with Christmas. Cause you, Feliz Navidad. Is, is that really your favorite Christmas song? Feliz Navidad. What about yours, dear? <laughs> I think my favorite is, I don't know, like I think like Silent Night, but from John Denver and the Muppets. Look at my I don't know that song. <laughs> you missed it, but your uh, Tia Hungria just explained to me how Jesus sent Santa Claus to give all the toys for the baby Jesus. I don't know how she worked those two and together. And I told but... everybody I knew where I came from. <laughs> What's your favorite so Christmas song? I think I like Silent Night. And I like uh, Little Drummer Boy. I like that one. What's your favorite Christmas movie? You said you've been watching a lot of Christmas movies. Oh, uh, man. I don't know. I really don't like any of them. <laughs> I don't. I tried to watch them, but no. Why is that so dark? It's the baby. The filter. Mm -hmm. It's the filter. Is it time for Christmas shot? It is. No, we have an hour and 15 minutes still. An hour and 15 minutes. An hour. Ed is over there like he is Santa Claus waiting at the mall for like people. Woo! <laughs> 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 yeah. You got, when did you get in? Two days ago? Yesterday? Uh, whatever is the 21st, yeah. Have you days done days anything since you were in town? I slept. You slept? I slept a lot. I wore six days a week and then I went so, with oh, my friends right before I came Can I bring out, up something so. sensitive? Yeah. Because I talked about it on my vlog before. Just for a couple yes. minutes. Yes, you can. So Maya was in the shooting that occurred in Las Vegas. She was working that event. Yes, I was. And it was horrible, wasn't it, sweetheart? It was the absolute worst experience I would never wish upon anyone. And I am extremely thankful to be here. I'm extremely happy. I never complain about being an Indiana for the first time. I know. I'm so, so that means something. And you're such a blessing. I'm so yeah. thankful that you're so, here. I'm really happy that I'm here. Um, and we just found out yesterday because Maya is so humble that she would never tell anybody this. Mm. But she actually oh, posted on Facebook pulled some girls anything. in and it really helped some girls. I did. Alex told me that. He, she Try has never said people. anything about it. But I'm yeah. so happy that you're safe because it's I'm scary as shit. Here. You were right there. Yeah. Right there. We, yeah. We, so. I was legit face to face with uh, death. Oh, I love you. I love you too. And uh, I'm just happy to be here. That's all. So now back to happy times. Yes, Alex is happy back. times. Happy times hey. are here again. Hey. Na, 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 na. Merry Christmas. Okay, let's get off here. Everybody say Merry Christmas. And a Merry Christmas, year. Manny, Mo, and Jeff. <laughs> Merry Christmas, Ed. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. 25 minutes, Carly. <laughs> How long, Carlitos? Carlitos is tracking it on the NORAD Santa, and in 25 minutes, Santa Claus will be here. So, I want to explain to everybody what you're about to see. When Santa Claus comes, now where will he drop the presents, Carlitos? What? Where will Santa Claus drop the presents? Uh, flies. He'll, where will he do it? He'll fly over the house and drop them in the yard. Yeah. And then what will, will the doorbell ring? And then what happens when the doorbell rings? You go outside. You do? No, all of them. All of us go outside? Is that why you have your coat? Did your mommy put your coat on underneath your onesie? It's like, it's like a, I, I, I'm really big sick. You're big sick? No, I, I, no I, I, it's like. It's like I'm really big, I, I'm really big fat, like, I, I really, big, like, <laughs> mommy, mommy, <laughs> I, I'm just like fat, really fat, like, like, we don't like, use that word though, that word's not nice, I, I mean, I mean, I just, I, I was like, like you have a tummy ache, yeah, I think, I, I, uh, I look like I eat too much sugar, right? You look like you eat too much? Yeah. But you didn't eat hardly anything for dinner. You just had a little bit of chicken salad, right? Uh, Was it good? Has, now, 
Has Sebastian been a good boy? So anyway, I wanted to show you that because when the when the door don't forget your tablet. <gasps> Twenty minutes. No, it's So I know. You better go in there and see if everybody else knows what time it is and tell them. <laughs> I so remember being a kid and not being able like I couldn't wait for Santa Claus to come. Okay, so what will happen is Carlos. Okay, so what will happen now if you're watching this video right now with your children You want to turn this off and this is not probably going forward a video for youngsters to watch Because we're gonna tell some secrets <laughs> So are all the youngsters away? I've given you a warning because parents have gotten shitty with me this year. We're explaining Santa Claus Ed <laughs> So um what will happen is the doorbell will ring and Carlos, my brother-in-law, will go outside, he'll like ring the doorbell and you'll hear it and he'll go like ding ling 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 ling. I'll try to catch it on video. It's so cute. And then like Carlitos will like go and open the door and all the presents will be in the yard because Santa Claus will have like, do you hear my family in the other room? It's craziness. So then <laughs> I'm in here like enjoying the peace and quiet of the tree for a few minutes. Um, but anyway, and then everybody will go outside and enjoy the presents, but he's really the only one that gets presents from Santa Claus. But we were, um, Alex and I and Maya were looking at NORAD Santa with him, which is like a tracking device. Yes, I'm coming. I'm coming. It was like a tracking device to look at Santa, and he was like getting so excited because he was like, Santa's in Grand Rapids. That's so close to us. Okay, so I'll be back. Hey Carlita or Carlos, could you do that dance move for us again, please? Oh, the happy couple. We haven't even started Christmas presents yet. Did you want to do that dance move again? I'm about to do the 69 right now, so <laughs> Carlos. <laughs> What are you doing? Are you dancing? Are you dancing? You're dancing? She wasn't even having that. What time is it? What time is it? Oh my lord! Santa Claus, stop crying. Stop crying, Santa Claus. Oh my lord! How much longer? Feliz Navidad, Esther. I think she's as tired as I am. How much longer do we have? Two minutes. Two minutes? Will the cuckoo clock go off? Not yet. Do you see him out there? Almost. Do you see? I see the, I see the light. Can you see the? Do you see Santa Claus out there? No, not yet. Oh my lord. Why is the lighting so bad in my camera? <laughs> She told me I got extra lights. Do you see him out there? 
Mira, 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 mira,
Ay, qué caja tan apretada. También. Yo pensaba que está apretada. ¡Ay, ay, ay! ¡Ay, el mismo, el mismo pensamiento tuyo, me la misma servilleta. Ya, perdóname que sea tan lento. Es tan lento. Es lo que está. Que lo abra. Que lo abra. Que lo abra. ¿Qué es lo que está? 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 ¿Qué es lo se me olvidó. ¡Ay, ay, ay! ¡Ay, 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 ay! Super. Ay, no, no cállese. Mis oídos no pueden oír a estos. Oh, 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 oh. Viste que cuando estoy al lado tuyo que me salen esas cosas. ¡Tía Maya! ¡Tía Maya! ¡Ay, 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 <laughs> What'd you get? Oh, I got a Marjik of wallet. <laughs> because it's just so much. Oh, you did! Say thank you. Thank you. That's a beautiful wallet. It is really nice. Okay, for Mark Jacobs. Hello. Ah, ah. Mami, me no me quiere tocar más el lí. Mami. ¿Por qué? Ah, porque me quedo. Ay, ya, le quiero. Hello, you guys. Well, I just wanted to end this Christmas Eve vlog by talking for a little bit. Such a wonderful, wonderful evening. And there were a lot of things I couldn't show you because there was so much music. But, well, first of all, I just have to tell you, I, I'm trending on Twitter right now, which is crazy. And the trending topic is most beloved man on YouTube. And um, this person tweeted out, I wanna get this correct. Lady Edeltrod, it's really teared me up, said, you are a rich man, Peter Mon. You are beloved by more than you realize, just like Jimmy Stewart at the end of It's a Wonderful Life. You win and Mr. Potter is foiled again. And it was one of my mom's favorite movies and I thought, you know, that's so interesting because my concept of whatever a higher power is a lot of times comes through other people and how they act and how they're, I see God in other people and their actions, you know? And uh, I was able to relax, nothing happened tonight, I, you know, Got to hang out with my husband, my brother-in-law Carlos, and his wife Liliana planned this whole thing for it to be exactly like a Venezuelan Christmas that they hadn't had forever, where they like had like they played live music really loud at the end, and it's on my Snapchat if it's still up when you guys look. And um, like it, it's like Mardi Gras in Christmas in Venezuela, and. Um, so they like gave out beads and 
you know, masks and disguises and everybody was dancing and they had those glow sticks that you break and um, then they gave out awards to everybody and they gave me Best YouTuber of the Year award. Which was like surreal because they don't get this, you know, but they like knew what I was going through and they knew that like it was hard and so that was like their way to like support me. And I just feel like so incredibly loved tonight, you know, and I just took the dogs out because Alex like came home and like crashed. It's like, it's literally like 3.30 in the morning and I said, he goes, are you coming in or are you know, you know, like go drive around and listen to your audiobook for a little bit or something because a lot of times I don't talk about this on here a lot but like I have a really hard time sleeping it's not just because I'm a night owl but like I have a hard time falling asleep <clears throat> and it's not that I need to reset my clock or anything like that I've always been this way ever since I was a little kid I've actually think I've talked about this on here before and uh, so I said a lot of times if I listen to like my audiobook I go home and then like I just go right to sleep and I said, you know, I really haven't had a chance the last, like, two or three days. And, and I had said that I felt like my Christmas was ruined. I feel like I had the most magical Christmas I possibly could have. And, you know, in retrospect, I think, like, I don't know that I would have appreciated how beautiful my family is and how wonderful my Christmas was tonight had it not been a little bit for what I went through because, like, it really made me appreciate them even more. You know, my cousin Maya was so upset tonight, like, but, like, I'm um, not upset. She was crying emotionally because, I mean, she's really suffering some, you know, stress, post-traumatic stress related to having been so close to the firing zone of what, I mean, she was, like, I didn't want to bring it up on the video, but and she talked about it a little bit tonight later with us, but she was literally like so close to people that were gunned down and it still affects her on a daily basis. And you know, those are the things that really matter in life. I can be called, I can be called names. I can be accused of things. I can have allegations thrown against me. I know what's true and I know it's not. But when we lose people, when we lose family members and People that are important to us and things like that happen. There's, hor there are so many horrible things that happen in this world. There are so many people that die tragic deaths that will never get noticed, that will never get any kind of validation or acceptance. You know, and I think about that, and I think like, so if this is the worst thing that ever happens to me, I guess I'm pretty lucky in life. You know, and I guess I feel just like really like very very blessed for the life that I have and. I was standing out here with the dogs. I took the dogs out, and um, I absolutely got a white Christmas this year. I got every bit of the white Christmas that I wanted. And um, there's something very pure and simple to me about the paw print of a dog in the snow. And I was thinking about this, like, I keep a list in a notebook of things that I love, and I meant to go inside and I forgot and I'll do it when I go back in there but um, I wanted to write down the paw print of a dog in the snow and I had just like Boo Radley's hair was getting real long his hair his you know his hair his fur was getting real long in front of his eyes and he couldn't see and he's so funny and so like I set him up on the bathroom counter and he just laid down the bathroom counter like he was on the side of a riverbank taking a nap you know and he let me trim up his eyes and of course you know just botched like Tucker's and he don't, he, he, don't, he don't care. He doesn't care, you know? And he got so excited because he could see, you know? He could see again, and it's like... I'm ready to get back to that. I'm ready to get back to... Just, you know... Enjoying those small things again. I'm going to show you guys. This is like the snow that I got tonight. Now, you know how important it was for me to get a white Christmas. So here, let me turn the brights on. But like, do you see? Aww. Like, I didn't just get like, we got like three inches of snow. Like, it snowed all day. Here, I will show you. Like, it snowed all day. Look at that. It's 
funny because my aunt lived one block over from where I live now most of my life. And so it's interesting when I like drive down these streets, you know, and I think about my aunt. It's been a year and Alex and I were driving to his, uh, aunt. we were driving to his aunt's house tonight and I said, this is the first year in like literally like a long time that I haven't spent Christmas with my cousin Caroline. And um, I said to Alex, I said something about, I was talking about my Uncle Dave, and he said something about that was the last time we saw him. And I said, that wasn't the last time we saw my Uncle Dave. We just saw him at Thanksgiving. He goes, no, that was the last time that we saw your Aunt Kathy. And I said, Christmas was? And he said, yeah, she passed away right after Christmas. My mother and my aunt loved Christmas so much. They always made it so special, you know? And in, in the way that they, they could, given the world they grew up in, you know? And so, I'm thankful. I've had an amazing Christmas, you know? think that maybe I would have liked to have it not had to have been at the expense of this horribleness that goes along with it, but I will prevail. I'll get through it. I've gotten through 10 times, 100 times worse things in my life. And um, can't keep a good man down. And I will learn from this. And I'm practicing patience and serenity, tolerance, love, compassion. And uh, I have a design for living today, you know, that allows me to look at situations in a different way and to turn my wounds into wisdom and to pray for people and to trudge forward and hope that I can be a role model and an example for other people. That's, that's the best that I can do, you know. We're, we're none of us perfect, but... Like I say, it's the bitter and the sweet. And this week has totally proved that. But today has been pretty sweet. It really has. And it looks like uh, Alex and I might be taking a trip to Los Angeles here in a couple weeks. And uh, so, yeah. And um, some other really cool things happened today that I can't really talk about yet. But... Um, I think that movie reference is so perfect for tonight. It, it really, really is because, you know, I mean, it really is a wonderful life. I love you guys, and I hope you are having an amazing Christmas day. I hope you're spending time with your friends and family. If you can't be with them this year, like my brother-in-law, Juan Carlos, and his girlfriend, Jesse. I love you guys. Merry Christmas. I know you can't be with us. We miss you. Um, and to all those other people out there that are spending Christmas alone or they don't have anybody to spend Christmas with, um, go back, watch some of my videos. I'm thinking of you. I'm, you know, it sucks. And uh, treat yourself better today. Go get a tub of your favorite kind of ice cream. Watch a movie you wanted to see. Treat yourself well. You deserve it. And uh, I love you guys. And I'll talk to you later. Bye.